Hey y'all. So, <clears throat> this of course is Spirit Iron Knife. Really think they uh, did a really great job with this figure. As you see, he's wearing Union Blue with a, a khaki trousers. Uh, he's got a gauntlet, but that's for his eagle. As you see up here, that's the eagle. Now, if you don't know, that's Freedom. Anybody is a Joe guy knows. This is one of my. This I think this is one of the best ones they've ever done. He's got a very iconic American look, in my opinion. Uh, naturally, he's Native American. I can't remember what um, nation the character Spirit belonged to. I want to say it was maybe Navajo. I'm not sure. But it gives me a. Uh, a strong remembrance of John Ford's classic westerns. Uh, you see here he has a sheath. Uh, he's got a belt with harness. 1911 right off the bat. It's the best one to get. Uh, two World Wars. Um, my opinion that that's the best pistol ever made. Your miles and vary. Here, very H and K looking type of rifle, either as a marksman or as a scout, which is what I believe uh, the character Spirit was a scout. Backpack is down here with a uh, with a mount or a ledge for uh, for freedom. He's number thirty six. Artwork in the back still sucks. Artwork on the side. Um, great looking character. Really got. I really think they knocked this one out of the ballpark. It's so far out of the GI Joe line uh, for classified of the top five best. Uh, it looks like he's got some kind of Spanish concha uh, right there on his belt. And uh, yeah, that's it. So. If you're not collecting all of them, I would definitely have this one collected out of the group. But uh, speaking of the collection, I have no idea what in the Sam Hill Hasbro is doing. I am not a huge, knowledgeable collector of toys. Um, when this came out, I don't even like, I do not like the Classified series. I want the 3 and 3 quarter series, but I'm understanding that they've done away with the 3 and 3 quarter if anyone's a Joe guy uh, and you know more about this than I do, please let chime in. But the way I'm understanding it is they're done with the three and three quarter, which is a damn pity. But that's the way it goes, I reckon. Um, they've come out with a six inch retro card back edition. And I don't know how long that's going to play out either. But I mean, you know, these are six inch. So, just keep them like this and put the file card on the back and maybe I'd like it more. But, you know, three and three quarters for me the way to go. Uh, one, because it's easier to deal with. They don't take up so much bloody ass space uh, for my, um, my wall, which, you know, right now is getting kind of crowded and I'm trying to figure out what to do about it. Um, but... I, I don't know what's going on with the GI with the GI Joe Hasbro line. It just it's not making any sense. Um, I guess you know once again from what I see on YouTube, what what people are saying that they're done with the three and three quarter, which is a a, a drat and shame. But anyhow, if anyone else knows, please chime in. Be back directly.